Fox News, Bill O'Reilly and Megyn Kelly clash over sex claims. Former Fox News host Bill O'Reilly has hit back at presenter Megyn Kelly's incomprehensible comments involving reports of sexual harassment at the news channel, U.S. Media Report. Ms. Kelly said Mr. O'Reilly's suggestion that nobody had complained about his behavior at Fox was false. I know because I complained, she said. Mr. O'Reilly retorted, I don't know why, Kelly, is doing what she's doing. I've helped her dramatically in her career. Mr. O'Reilly has denied any wrongdoing. In an interview with radio host Glenn Beck on Monday, Mr. O'Reilly said he had never had a problem with Ms. Kelly. When she was getting hammered earlier this year, I wrote a column sticking up for her, he said. Mr. O'Reilly said that he was not going to run and hide from allegations of sexual harassment at the company, but added that he wanted the story to go away because it's brutalizing my family. On Monday, Ms. Kelly used her NBC Today show to criticize Mr. O'Reilly and Fox News over reports in the New York Times of a $32 million, 24 million pounds, settlement paid to former Fox legal analyst Liz Wheel to settle a sexual harassment case. That is not a nuisance value settlement, that is a jaw-dropping figure, Ms. Kelly said. O.J. Simpson was ordered to pay the Goldman and Brown families $33.5 million for the murders of Ron and Nicole, she added, what on earth would justify that amount? What awfulness went on? Ms. Kelly, who left Fox to join NBC earlier this year, said she had sent an email to several Fox News executives in November 2016 in relation to Mr. O'Reilly's alleged behavior. Your email, she said suggested that perhaps Mr. O'Reilly didn't realize the kind of message his criticism sent to young women when he talked about the issue of speaking out about sexual harassment. Perhaps he didn't realize that his exact attitude of shaming women into shutting the hell up about harassment on grounds that it will disgrace the company is in part how Fox News got into the decade-long, Roger, Isles mess to begin with, she said. In an interview with CBS News, also in November 2016, Mr. O'Reilly was asked about a chapter in Ms. Kelly's memoir relating to the former Fox News chairman Roger Ailes and alleged sexual harassment at Fox News. I'm not interested in basically litigating something that is finished that makes my network look bad, he said. That doesn't interest me one bit. Mr. O'Reilly was forced to resign in April following a raft of sexual harassment allegations. The settlement with Ms. Wheel, which was extraordinarily large for such cases, according to the Times, is one of six involving O'Reilly that are in the public domain, totaling $45 million. Several of those suits involved Mr. Riles, who stepped down in 2016 amid accusations of harassment which he denied. He died in May.